hello my pretties what's up i want to check on the energy with y'all normally i have the um the cards pre-pulled for time purposes but i guess y'all can rock with me today um somebody's gonna die y'all excuse me um okay sorry to say it like that um there could be a person who's gonna pass away who live their life recklessly or they did some reckless shit i feel like when they die they're gonna die with shame i feel like if this is an elder they're gonna die with shame um but i feel like if this is uh yeah wow they saying that for whoever this person is that's gonna pass away it may be at nighttime right and i can feel it coming in the air tonight oh lord I've been waiting for this moment for all my life. This person know they live in a in a in a in a in a fucked up manner. You know what I'm saying? And they saying that when they soul separate from their body, they're going to um be in that nine of swords, head in the hands type energy. Like, damn. You know what I mean? I feel like this person did some shit and they're ashamed about it. But anyway. That's separate. For those of you that are going through some serious warfare, I know I don't tell y'all enough, but um, go on my website, theprettyoracle.com. I have so many things there for you guys that are going through warfare. My spiritual warfare candles have been carrying people that have been suffering for months, all right? I'm going to start putting them back up here, but there was... um. I don't be having enough. As soon as I get them, they sell out. You understand what I'm saying? But I do have... I do have... um some that i'm looking at right now and i'm gonna put i'm gonna put i'm gonna leave some up here so that you guys can be um reminded of the fact that i have them all right so anyway so we have celebration and restriction and discipline yeah for somebody this person that 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 um may have passed away or is going to is child they said it's set to pass away may have tried to stop you on your journey and i feel like the way they did it was was really grimy okay some of you guys may be feeling insecure about moving forward towards your purpose i feel like um there may be some procrastination and restriction okay um i just heard the scientist somebody name may be mariah I feel like you're, you know, there's something stopping you from your own success, period. Yeah. I heard you have the tools. I mean, what's up? What's the problem? You have the tools. Go go for, go forward and be great. I know one of the readers that I did before, um, it spoke about a entity that was attached to, to you that could be trying to make you procrastinate, trying to make you overindulge or uh, be distracted and stuff like that. Yeah, this this contemplation, this is procrastination right here. It's like you keep you 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 may be thinking of ideas, but are you putting any of them to good use? You know what I mean? Like just get up and do it, y'all. We spoke about this. It's like they they say and choose something. Um, Leo energy is here. Jump in, jump in the energy of your strength. Um, and so. I done spoke to y'all on the live about my nails. Like, it's just, this is like respectable young lady nails. I don't like them, okay? Anyway. um, Because my nails need to be long. And they need to be neon or black or white or something like that. But this is giving... Aww. And me not like that. But anyway... Um, stay positive, you guys. Okay, I, I, I told to y'all about this thing about po positivity um, to the point of delusion sometimes as, as it, you know, pertains to your manifestations and your goals and your dreams and aspirations, you guys. But they're saying you need to, somebody been eating a lot of fish, but they're saying that you need to um, Stop thinking about all the variables in a situation. Like, it feels like if you want to do something and you keep thinking about, but if I go this way, when I go this way, should I do this or should I do that? Like, just contemplating too much. When they saying, like, make a decision, okay? Stay positive about it and just move forward. Like, you're, 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 you're thinking about it so much that you don't even realize that you're stopping. Like, 
forward movement is going to always be important, okay? Child. Listen. Some of y'all listening to advice from a hermit. Um, you know, somebody who... Somebody listening to advice from somebody that you don't need to, okay? You just don't. This feel like a, a hermit, um, a person who feel like they know something. Um, I don't know if this person... Show me, show me. Hold on. There's somebody you could be dealing with sexually. It could even be a partnership. It could be a friendship. They saying, you listening to this person for what? The person name may start with a W. You listening to this person and, you know, you're not getting the best of advice. There's, there's something here that, that, that makes, yeah. Like, I feel like this person is confusing you, making you go back on certain things. Right now, your journey is yours, you guys. And, and you only need to be listening to spirit. Like, come on now. Yeah, you see this energy of go with the flow? Uh, that's what I'm saying. You only need to be listening to spirit. I feel like somebody is giving you bad advice or some shit like that. And even if this person's um, intentions are not to give you bad advice, it's just like... What's good for the goose is not always good for the gander, okay? Like, with this person's, uh, their way of life or their way of thinking may not work for you. You are on your own specific journey, okay? That's for somebody. What song is that, is that that I'm hearing? I don't know what song that is, y'all, but it's from the 80s or some shit like that. I don't even know the words. I'm just hearing it. Okay? So for some of you guys, y'all might know that song. Look at this. We have kinship, community, and your group. Okay. So this is this is what was making me feel like. Who is it that you're connected to that um you don't need to be fucking listening to? Excuse me, y'all. Look at that judgment. This is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm saying. So for some of y'all, you're listening to somebody who really don't, you know, they don't know what, either they don't know what they are talking about. They don't have your best interests at heart. They're trying to stop you from some sort of celebration that you support or, 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 um, some milestone in your life purposely. Okay. Watch who you hanging out with. Yeah, because you shine on your own is what I'm hearing. But some of you guys, you supposed to have a child. So, yo. I'm sorry, y'all. But some of y'all, you supposed to have a child and the child is going to be special. But I'm going to tell you right now, it's not going to be human. I'm, I don't know what the hell I'm tapping into. Um, the child is not going to be human, okay? That particular child is going to come with a spirit guide. And I'm going to be honest with y'all. It looked like some sort of dragon energy that your child may be um, a part of or fairy. Is this fairy? This could even be like mar a marine spirit child. Um, I know a lot of marine spirits are negative, but not all of them are, okay? But this is a special child. It makes me feel like there's a group um, of somebody trying to manipulate you. And I told y'all this before already. Distract you, manipulate you, take you the wrong way. Yeah, four of cups make you feel discontented with your life or your journey that you, you know, appreciated before or that you were already on. Yeah, this is like procrastination. I just heard see no evil, hear no evil. And with that energy, you could probably be knowing that these people that you're hanging out with ain't shit or that they don't have your best interest at heart or that they're not for you or whatever the case is. But it's just like, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah. These people want you to trust in their communication. They want you to trust that they are the people to listen to. For some, for some of y'all, they just told me that um, 
these people are living a certain sort of life or this person may be living a certain sort of life and they want you to be living in that kind of life too. They want to live that kind of life with you for, for a specific reason. I just heard they want to ride your coattails. Let me tell y'all something. Um, I used to have a friend who she didn't have the juice when it came to the menses in them like I did. <laughs> Woo. I mean, um, she could pull them, but she couldn't, you know, keep them interested or whatever the case is. And, um, I thought she really fucked with me, but, um, at the end, you know, spirit was just telling me like, yeah, you know, um, look at this. Look what I look. Um. At the time I was, I was, uh, at the time I was hanging out with her, I was already involved with somebody. But anyway, um, I used to go out with her and stuff like that. And I feel like she used to just use me as like, you know, like the worm on the hook to pull the men's them in or whatever the case is. <laughs> Word. And so even though, you know, I wasn't really interested in that at the time, because I was already involved with somebody who was, you know, pretty much treating me well. Um, I, I still did it. And so I'm using this as an example. Okay. Um, some people want you to live the, the type of life that they're living. Okay. Because it suits them. It helps them. Even though that may not be exactly what it is that you're doing right now. I told y'all before too, I felt the energy of somebody trying to get you to do some sort of spell work or, or, or go to a graveyard or some shit like that. Or, or do some type of magic that you are not into. Okay, don't do it. Don't do it. There's also somebody that they're telling me about that may try to get you to do a spell with them. Don't tie your energy up in that. I'm hearing this person. I'm hearing the advice from this person is to, for you to have a drink. A spider may be significant here. A spider tattoo may even be significant. You see that energy that I just pulled of recognition and support? I'm telling you, it's people that just want to ride your coat, coattails because you're the empress or because you a hot gal or a hot boy or because your aura is strong or because whatever. You get a lot of attention with this recognition energy. They know whether, you know, this is the opposite sex or, or this is a romantic situation. They already know having you on their arm. Is going to bring them the type of attention and success that they need. Okay? Um, don't do it. Don't do it. These are these is people that just want to ride your coat. They're gonna they're gonna wind up stopping you from, you know, being on your journey and receiving what it is that you need to receive, okay? So that's the message for to for, for right now. I'll expand on this, all right, you guys. But let me just drop that jewel and I'm and I hope that helps. Let me pull from right here. Okay. So that's the main thing, basically. You getting distracted, um, too many people putting things in your head. I feel like there's too many cooks spoiling the broth, too many opinions. Music is essential to your healing and well-being, whether singing, playing an instrument, or listening. Somebody's going to hear a song in a store that's going to, to help you hump back, hump back. Somebody may have a... Um, somebody may have a hump back. I'm, I'm hearing this one of your ops. Child, they just said, um, whoever this person is with a humpback, they got a, um, this is none of my business, but they, they are, um, not very well endowed. They not blessed in the area of, of, of genitals. They got shit to do with me. I'm just trying to help somebody out. I don't even feel like saying that shit just now. Anyway. You're too enmeshed in this situation. Step back and see the bigger picture before making any decisions or taking action. Yeah, because I feel like your 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 thinking about what it is that somebody may have told you or 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 too engulfed in the advice that you're receiving from others. Okay. So take yourself out, out of, step step back from the situation and take a look at it, okay? But there's something here 
that's stopping you from making decisions as far as business and goals and opportunities are concerned because you're overthinking it. Um, and then as far as life is concerned and camaraderie and, and, and romantic relationships and shit like that, you are accepting too much advice or listening to too, too much advice that you don't need. Like it, it, Somebody needs to find a balance between work and play, okay? Because there's, there's, there's an outside energy that just wants you to fuck up. They want you to choose the wrong thing. And you know what I'm saying? Purposely. Some of you guys need to be listening to music when you're sleeping. Um, singing bowls is what I, is what I prefer. But definitely um, healing while you're sleeping is, is, is what I'm getting as well. For some of you guys, um, I know gospel music gives me strength. Certain gospel songs gives me strength. Um, some of you guys could play um, the eight-hour prayers that they have here on YouTube. Play them loud in your home. And I feel like, you know, it's going to shift the energy, okay? All right, y'all. I hope that helped.